welcome back today we will do a bit of unboxing and, uh, and a quick review of this timepiece received just today very good packaging received all the way from China See, this is a very presentable watch case. Very nicely done. What do you think? A carrying case for, for the watch. Nicely done. Let's see. What's inside of it? And there it is. hope what I see here is the plastic and not a broken glass let's see we'll peel it off and, and see what that is yeah it's probably plastic oh good that's a good sign Not easy. Yes, it is plastic. Good. That's a relief. Okay. There it is. So far, I, I'm, I like what I see here. It's an awesome, awesome timepiece. Obviously, is in bronze case but that's what I was expecting and that's the reason why I ordered it in the first place I see that there is a warranty card completed here date of purchase that's good and a bit of a manual I suspect and all in Chinese oh no there's English here that's good okay what else is there not much well, anyway, it's a good carrying case. Oh no, look at this. There's also a tool to remove the the strap if you want to. That is very nice of them to provide both of these things. There's another plastic here. I'll have to peel it off. I don't know about you, but it I absolutely love this watch the way it looks like um, to give you an idea of um, the dimensions of this um, uh, timepiece is uh, it's 47 millimeters in diameter but because of the lugs are being recessed under the um, this road here um, it's only 43 millimeters lug to lug and um, and therefore it wears much smaller than it is and it is 15 millimeters um, tall with this slightly domed sapphire crystal on, top, uh, crystal on top of it as you can see the crown here is signed with that shark image and the case back here is absolutely stunning to me uh, looks stunning to me it says an age 35 moment divers 300 meters all, all stainless steel sapphire crystal and that uh, image of the shark there I think it's interesting um, looking at the dial we can see um, at six uh, at three o'clock position there is a date obviously um, the crown here is a screw down there it is I'll show you there and it's very very smooth winding action on this watch I'm, I'm, I really like that I really like the smooth winding action of this timepiece uh, at the six o'clock position it says marine master and um, professional right 
300 meters and um, look at the at the bit of a uh, green hue that uh, this dial gives you I, I don't know about you but I really like that to be honest with you um, it sometimes it looks absolutely black but at this light you can see uh, that, that it shows that it is um, green and um, San Martin at 12 o'clock you don't need to guess twice to to uh, uh, to figure out what design elements they borrowed here and that would be marine master Seiko marine master tuna uh, watch which is um, by the way 48 millimeters in diameter and this um, bronze case here is uh, 43 million 40 45 i said oh sorry 47 47 yeah so the seiko tuna is 40 48 and this one is 47 uh, but it wears very nicely um now the bezel action is 60 click here as you can see the alignment is absolutely perfect there's no play whatsoever it's easy to turn absolutely easy to turn the, the bezel uh, even even though there's a restriction here uh, because of this uh, shroud here as, as it is on on Seiko tuna but um, I don't know about you but I really really like that um, the I weighed this watch it's 144 grams um, which is uh, less than I thought it would be to be honest with you um, what else I wanted to say um, the Aliexpress where I purchased this uh, watch uh, Aliexpress page says that it's not only sapphire crystal but also sapphire ring on top of the bezel here I don't know what do you think could that be the case I guess it could right I mean I don't see why not but uh, I've never seen that before to be honest and if it is the case I'm, I really do like that what I wanted to show you also is a bit of a loom picture here here it is it's loom, uh, loomed as you can see um, our markers and the, and the and hands and the second hand and also bezel markers pretty good loom I like it okay what else is here oh very nice buckle by the way it says Saint Martin here it's a bronze uh, bronze buckle um, the strap I should say the strap is is uh, very very nice and uh, wears very nicely look at this a detail of a shark here at the end of the strap and uh, I'll um, demonstrate to you right now how it looks like on my wrist okay and then we will put it on on a time grapher so we can see how it, it was regulated when out out of the factory it was I must say it was delivered rather quickly uh, by Aliexpress here it is what do you think I think it wears very nicely on my seven and a quarter inch, inch wrist that's what I have here now and uh, and that's, uh, let's put it on a term grapher okay okay It's 52. Okay, good. I, I was checking the lift angle. I wonder if you could see. Yeah, you could. You could see that it shows. It started with plus two seconds and then jumped to minus four seconds per day in the dial up position, minus five. Uh, amplitude is 277 and the bit error is zero that makes me very very happy okay um, I really like what I see here and uh, yeah and, um, 
Okay, um, I don't know what else to say. I will wear this watch for a while and then uh, we'll share with you the, the, uh, my, my impressions about it, uh, how it wears, how it uh, looks and uh, how I experienced that. And then now we'll, um, we'll have a proper review after that. Okay, thank you and bye.